in this video i will be giving you guys the best jump shot on nba 2k25 proven by 2k labs what the fuck That nigga selfie fell on the light of the front end. If you want to be showing like a demon, leave me a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Also, hit the bell so every time I make a video, you guys know about it first. Let's get right into the video. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I will be giving y'all the best jump shots on NBA 2K25. I got a screenshot of all the best jump shots from 2K Labs that I will be using in a series of videos. Now, the series of videos is going to be me using the jump shots, but I'm going to give you all of the best jump shots that 2K Labs have found. And you guys can go ahead and use the ones that you think you would do best with and go ahead and use them. But the videos are just solely so that you guys can see the animations, get my rating for these jump shots. But I'm going to make a series of me using all of these 2k labs best jump shots and rate them myself but in this specific video i will be using the biggest green window for small guards so if that's what you're looking for watch this rest of this video to see the animation and also my rating and my thought about the jump shot but with that being said i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys all of the jump shots for all build proven by 2k Labs. so first we're gonna start with small guards then go up and height And like I said earlier, in this specific video, I will be using the highest green window jump shot for small guards proven by 2K Labs. And the jump shot I'm using in this specific video is the Dick Barnett, Oscar Robinson, Oscar Robinson, 100 blending. The animation for this jump shot is actually a little funny, but um, with that being said, let's get it. So here we got the gameplay with the jump shot, the highest green window jump shot that NBA 2K Labs had given out. As you guys seen in those screenshots, um, I'm going to go over this gameplay with y'all. I'm going to talk about the gameplay and I'm going to talk about the jump shot and when I think about the jump shot because I've used it. And for some of y'all that just want to know if this jump shot is good or not and want to see the animation in game, this is the video for y'all for me. So I start off, I'm playing 3v3 in the, in the theater. Um, when I don't got nobody to play with, I play no squads in there. I'm playing with the jump shot on and the first shot I take is going to be a fade I'll go to the side right here and after again his ankles a little bit and try to go for a fade now here's one thing that I know about the Oscar Robinson release because this jump shot is based Dick Dar Barnett but with double Oscar Robinson Oscar Robinson is not a jump shot that is good with fading so if you like to fade a lot it is not good what the fuck that's us all right there i did green the standing jump shot right there and the people in game were talking shit about my jump shot but they won't be talking shit too long because i'm gonna start greening shit after this for me um the jump shot is a green machine on any standstill jump shots it is also very good with holding square or x to shoot Button shooting is good with this jump shot. It's easier to time this jump shot with button shooting. See, the first time I shot, they were talking shit about my jump shot. The second time, they're saying I'm chicken. You know what I'm saying? So, you feel me? If you somebody who get talk shit to and game chat a lot, you know what I'm saying? This jump shot will have them talking shit. I got a little late right there. Cause this jump shot is a fast jump shot um if you like fast jump shots this is jump shot for you um the release is super quick but it has a high green window as you guys see um so it's easy to time once you know the timing like i said it's good for button shooting but it's not so good with rhythm shooting because of how fast you have to release 
rhythm shooting is kind of weird um, with this jump shot so those are the cons so far no fading and you can't really with I mean you can't really really rhythm shoot with this jump shot neither that should have been a steal he goes for the lay on my man he's not letting up but then he gets the board and puts it back he got that shit so right now I got six points and the other team is fouling me even though they was talking shit about my jumper I gotta be a threat the way he was reaching and trying to foul me right so I get the ball again I'm trying you know get open display that was a crab I should have shot that shit but man's is wide open in the corner bang see that's how people in the corner should be shooting for me like if you wide open in the corner you're not hitting your shots that's a shame yeah y'all gotta put them on with this jump shot video right here where i have literally all the best jump shots for all builds and someone i was running with before used to be 50. i sent him a screenshot for the for his height his, like the section with his height in it bro he picked the jump shot out of there and fucking started greening bro so send this video to all your centers and all your corner sitters They'll start greening with these jump shots, you feel me? It's gonna change their life. Like I told I told my man who start greening, I said, yo, that jump shot changes life. Here I go for another fade. As you can see, it's actually really hard to time the fades with this jump shot. And it's because of the release, um, Oscar Robinson. Oscar Robinson release is just a release that's not too well with um fading. So you just can't fade with that with that release on. But any standstill jump shots, look, I go for another one. I was trying to find the fade, trying to find the timing, or just green one at least so I could get the feeling for it. But, you know, us, like like I said before, Oscar Robinson is just not a fade and release. That nigga selfish as hell. I don't know why he so long. But green bean when you're standing, when you're standing still, any quick stops, you're going to be hitting those, you know. Any shots like those, you're going to be hitting those with this jump shot. It's really fast release, but it has a good green window. So, and the and the jump shot kind of go together. The base go with the jump shot. The way he kick his feet up is funny. Um, if you ever played NBA 2K20, I think it was two 2K22 set shot 25. I would compare this 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 base to set shot 25 base. You know what I'm saying? Uh, for those who like fast jump shots, you don't care about the animation or you like the animation. Then this is a good jump shot for you. Um, me personally, though, I don't like the base. Like I hate the kick the feet animation. It's too weird and it's too. I, I don't think it's too quick. I just think the animation is too like weird. So I can use it. But if y'all like it, it definitely got a good green window. Cause green ain't. You want green your shots, bro. So with all that being said, bro, if you like this video, leave me a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Also hit the bell so every time I make a video you guys know about it first. I got a couple videos coming out soon. So be on the lookout. And yeah, go ahead and put this jump shot on. Try it out for yourself. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.